the time bandit came out to visit us. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another Sunday morning cruise. What's up, Will? Or we are checking out Jason's new truck, his new old GMC. Steven, what's happening? He just picked that up. Pretty cool. Juan, good morning. We got a little bit of a gloom today compared to what we had yesterday. But it's not too horrible. We'll just give a little walk around the parking lot today. Then it's a big moving day. Then we're going to move. Fun, fun, fun. So how's everybody doing this fine Sunday morning? What's up, Christopher? I got my dirty car here. Oh, the parking lot's pretty full, but yeah, there's a few few missing here today. Morning, Will. If I didn't get you before, I, I saw you pop up. Sorry. <laughs> I like these old Fords. Yeah, I went there. I got there at like 1.30. Oh, that's why I didn't I caught some rollout. That's all I got, but... I had to work, so I got there a little late. Alberto, thanks for the super chat. I got the What's up, poker? kind of weather you guys got over there on Whittier today. Friday was horrible, man. I had friends uh, driving to Los Angeles Friday with almost zero visibility. Couldn't even see the car ahead of them on the I-15 from the fog and snow. Did you guys get any of that weather in Whittier? Yeah, it was chilly. It was nasty here Friday. Saturday was pretty nice, though. All right, I got schooled on some stuff today. This one doesn't have a chassis on it. It's not like a Galaxy, like the, this is a Fairlane. So I guess I've been giving wrong info. <laughs> That's a badass car. What's up, Speed? Mini truck. <laughs> oh yeah. Cliff finally got the Merc fixed and got the Merc out. One of my favorites. Here comes Mike.
<laughs> I love that thing. That thing is awesome. No car on the back today, though. It's one of the nicest car haulers in town. You got a new, a new heart, a new heart and engine bay. He's a beauty. That plush, comfy looking interior. Adam, what's cracking? Beautiful 49. What's up, Cheryl? Uh, I'm not, I don't know if I'm going to it, but I'm definitely probably going to see it. They're not blowing it up until like October from what somebody was telling me, but I don't know for sure. If I'm at work, we'll, we'll hear it go off. I don't know. They're probably going to do it in the middle of the night like they did all the others. I'm sure it be, will be very well televised. They've aired all the other implosions that they've had since I've been here. They're going to strip it all down first. They got to get all the stuff out of it. Then they're going to take all the windows out. What's up, Bitty Bitty? Welcome to the show. I didn't see no, no, uh, no VWs here yet today. Unfortunately, mine is, mine is down for the count for a moment. It's a Healy. Got some trucks. Yeah, the, I, I did get to go to the show yesterday for a little bit. I got some rollout footage. I posted all the pictures at 2 a.m. this morning. Oh, that's cool. They do have a great event out there. Was it in uh, Irwindale? Did you go to the one in Irwindale or was that the one in uh, Orange County? Oh, Cars and Coffee. Cool. We're still looking for a hood. Still looking for a hood for his truck. Unibody Ford. Yeah, that's a good one up in Irvine, that's for sure. OC is the originator of the cars and coffee. So, like I said, if anybody's got any leads for a hood for his unibody pickup truck, it's a Ferd. Like this one over here. We need a hood. See? It's like the same truck, almost like a before and after shot. <laughs> Love the color on this. What's up, Mike?
right? It's, yeah, it's definitely a nice blue. Shows up very well. Uh, yeah, about the parking stuff, yeah. Keep me posted. As I, I, I'm gonna have to get there probably super early since I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to bring the bug. I gotta find some place to park the Acura unless I can ride with somebody. I know they ain't gonna let my Acura in a lot. Seventy-one four fifty-four SS. <laughs> Ask me how I know. <laughs> I wish I had an El Camino. Always wanted one. When my son was born, his mama had a 78 red El Camino sitting on Craigers. My son actually wants to get a, to get one and, and do it like that. Nice bird. Is the picture fine today? It seems a little glitchy. Where's Lolo? Got the Mopar. Fierro boys are out today. Take a Take a look at the unique, the unique Fieros. <laughs> Tell me a story. Remember when you guys had a Fiero? <laughs> Any of you guys ever own a Fiero? Come on, you can admit it. <laughs> They're cool. They were cool in their day. Morning, morning. That's a patina. What's up, flat four? Nah, it'll leave it the way it is. Maybe replace the windshield. The windshield's all cracked up. It just needs a glass. I had a Camaro. I had a 79 Z28. What's up, Frank Zito? I really love the color on that. Don't see too many 
maroon Firebirds of this generation. I like it. It's the only one around here that I know of. Shonda! Good morning. Hey, Mahala. Here comes Jeff. It's cool suburban. What's up, Phil? I hear you met a few a few of my friends yesterday that were admiring your car that were telling me all about. It. I'm like, yes, I know Phil. <laughs> Katana, what's happening? No, I didn't. Um, <laughs> there's one old caddy here, I think. Yeah. I haven't gotten to that aisle yet. It's moving day, Katana. We're gonna. I'm gonna be moving today after this. Getting ready to go pick up a U-Haul truck. <laughs> but I have to come over here first because I don't want to move. <laughs> I don't want to move. See ya. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty low suburban. I like it though, it's nice. There's a Cadillac. Just in case he's leaving, we'll go we'll get a drive by. There you go, Frank. 63. We got a chrome Impala. How about a chrome Impala? It's like cloaked. <laughs> chrome Impala. Bright red Mopar. Got got to love the Mopars. 440 Magnum. And yeah, Frank, there's the other Cadillac. The old school. Uh, we're just moving a couple couple miles over here, actually, uh, right down the block from my son. Right down the block. About six miles from this spot, maybe. Just downsizing. There's Levi's, Levi's Camaro. There's SS. Yeah. Yeah, was... yeah, pretty much, except it's ground level. <laughs> we got the foist floor. Too old for that stairs crap. <laughs> That thing is bright, very reflective. That's what we need to wrap your truck in chrome, man. <laughs> There's Johnny's bird. <laughs> a little bit, a little, it's a small piece of the pie. Downsizing. The only part I'm really disappointed about is that my bug no longer has a garage. It's 
It's going to be parked. It's really going to get patina down. It's going to be parked out in the elements. Yeah, it's all right. Patina's okay. I'm good with it. It's just going to be hot. It's going to be hot getting in that thing this summer. <laughs> Yeah, I got a car cover. I don't know if they allow the car covers in the apartment complex, though. We'll find out. We will find out. Yeah, I get the canopy. At least it'll be under the canopy. You get one one uh, canopy space per apartment, and we got three cars. So me and my wife will be parking out in the sun. While the bug gets the shade. Which is better than nothing. Roger, what's happening? It's turning out to get better here. Yes, turned out like yesterday. Yesterday was a beautiful day. Friday we had crappy cold wind and rain and kind of snow. Just odd. It's springtime. <laughs> the Mad Hatter. Uh, possibility. Possibility to store it over there. <laughs> Roy and Becky getting ready to come out here on vacation. Messaging me right now cool hope to see you soon roy becky the red rocket he's got a nice stripe on that i like the stripe it's nice very cool Beautiful 56. Roger, thanks for the super chat. Oh, check out the Oldsmobile. Four fifty five rocket. Hearse, Hearse Olds. It's got the red fender wells. Uh, for sure. I like it. This thing is nice. Got the his her shifter there. W thirty's awesome, dude. There goes Pastor Rob. In the time bandit. It's got the trumpet tail pipes. Very nice. This one right here sounds like a beast. It's a G8, I think. The Oldsmobile? Hell yeah, that thing is pricey. Very much so. Very much so. There you go, Shonda. Four door Jeep. Buddy Mike brought out his Mercedes.
and yeah the hood opens up like that that's awesome every hood every hood should open like that so you can work on a car Starting to thin out already. I thought I came on early today. <laughs> yeah, if you forget to latch it, then it's going to do that easy on your windshield, that's for sure. No lie there. There's Al's tea bucket. Well, Thumper's here too. I didn't even hear him pull in today. It's a nice little truck. Oh, geez. You guys want to see it? I'll, I'll, I'll go walk over there. But if you guys want to see one, I got one at Celebrity Cars, too. There you go, you saw it. <laughs> I can picture for the little brother. For the little brother? Oh, the little brother? <laughs> Look at Pimp Daddy Continental. Green. <laughs> I got to ride in one. I got to ride in one a couple of days ago, man. Now, I don't like the way they look. But I'm gonna tell you, it does take off like a bat out of hell. They're all fast. It is fast, fast that four wheel steering. The tech in them is great. Don't get me wrong, the tech is great, but man, is it fugly. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't say that when I'm at work. <laughs> when I'm off today, and that ain't the work vehicle. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't help it. <laughs> For what it can do, it's awesome. For what it looks like. <laughs> I think I drew that truck when I was in the third grade. I'm, I'm pretty sure of it. I have to go through all these boxes while I'm moving. I'm sure I can find a piece of artwork that looks like that truck when I was in the third grade. Got the Maverick out today. Morning! What's up, Waffle Stomp? <laughs> I don't know where everybody is today. Only Lloyd came out. Well, I'm here. Oh, you're here. 
We all know Thumper's here. We heard you come. Yeah, but I don't have my cutouts. No, not today. They're not working. Got to get it fixed. It's just a solenoid probably, right? The little no, motor. I think it's one of the motors. Mm. Yeah, he found it. I must have left it in Los Angeles when we moved away. Yeah, he says his cutout's not working today, unfortunately. No rumbly rumbly. Uh, let's see, we're going to go over here before everybody starts bailing out. All right, Kevin, you have a great day, man. Enjoy the rest of your week. I don't think I've seen this one here before. The white Pontiac? The Bonnie? How's it going? Hey, we got a Tesla truck in for you. You know you want one. I don't know. I don't know what size engine is that. What do you think? It's Pontiac Bonneville. I don't know my Pontiac motors at all. I have no clue. There, get you all a better look. It's a beautiful car though. Uh, tritone interior. My opinion, it's a perfect size car. I like this size. Love the taillights. Well, there's Thumper. Like I said, no cutouts today, but he's still pretty loud. So here's a Catalina. He's still got the eight lug, uh, the eight lug wheels on the Catalina. The Ranchero. I do like these, but the nose is too long. The nose protrudes too far in front of the front tires in my taste. But they're cool cars. That's a Ford thing. For a, lot of, a lot of the old Fords, their noses are too big. It's our little truck click back over here. How you like that Suburban? He was here last week. It's pretty nice. 376. Custom wheel wells. Yeah, that thing is awesome. I love the caps on those wheels. It's got third row. 
72, 1972. Remember riding in them back seats in the wagons back in the day? Remember? <laughs> There's a nice little short bed. Yeah, three doors. Two doors on the passenger side and only the driver's door. LV Junk, man. Thanks for the super chat, brother. Yeah, we had a, man, what do we have? 70, 70 or 71 Chevelle wagon. Actually had a seat in the back like that. I remember riding in that thing. Whew. Yeah, it's getting tight back here. Yeah, there's Mike COE. Pretty sure this thing is uh, powered by Caterpillar, I think, if I remember right. Something like that. G's in the house. Welcome. Welcome, G. Yeah, this thing is awesome. Like the TV's missing. <laughs> Look at that back seat. He got this thing out of steel, that's for sure. He definitely paid less than what it cost to build that sucker. The bargain of a lifetime, I'm sure. I think it's a 48, uh, 48 or a 47. I'm not 100%. I don't remember. Thank you, G. Thanks for that super chat, my friend. I just love the looks of that thing. It's just badass. Matt Williams, what's happening? Good morning, sir. It's a nice little vet. Yeah, I don't think they ever made a crew cab on that back in the day. Nice bike. <laughs> you got the nice bike. The hot ranchero. Gotta have Krakers on an old Ranchero, man. Just proper. <laughs> LS2. It's very nice, man. Nice crowd out here today, even though people are coming and going. It's a nice truck too. We lost the signal. We lost it. Something interfered. We're back though. What's up, Mark? 
Can you see? Are we good? Are we back? <laughs> I don't know. I hit a dead spot. Yeah. We hit a dead spot right over there. I don't know what the hell happened. You open up. Ooh, look at that. The bling bling. Big block. <laughs> Did you get rid of the other car? Okay. <laughs> no, it can't fit in everybody's. It won't fit in my garage. <laughs> this one looks good, though. Needs to be a little lower. <laughs> Looks good though. So damn near the same color as the other car. Just about. <laughs> All right. Let's see if anything else showed up back over here. Nothing, nothing except that Tesla. You guys want to see the Tesla again? I'll take you back over there. Could be a threat. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Mark. You know you want a Tesla. What's up, cat? <laughs> it's funny. They're going to be classic someday if they make it that far. If they make it that far. I keep hearing that they're rusting out, so I don't know. I don't know if they'll rust out here in the desert, but they're rusting out in California. There's a nice truck. Beautiful. Right, like old laptops. The uh, old laptops though are like two years these days, if you're lucky. What's going on, man? Looks good. Love it. Tesla. There it is. This is a Tesla. One of these days before you all die, you're gonna be in a Tesla. It's like one of those hear me now, believe me later. Watch, watch, it'll happen. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, no more insults, I won't do it to you. We'll, we'll leave it at that, okay? But I'll get you another look at it. There's a Tesla. <laughs> all right, folks. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for the super chats. Uh, we're done today. I'm going to go hurt myself and move furniture and uh, get the hell out of that house. Thanks for coming. I appreciate you, and we'll see you next week. Love y'all. Peace.